Hello, Jess Too Good here. Today I'm opening my first and only loot crate ever because a Facebook ad said this has one of five special LEGO Dimensions items. So I can't wait to see what is inside. I think you open it from the bottom right here. And I'll tell you, I really don't like these subscription box services. I think they just fill it with a lot of crap and make you try to get stuff inside. So this theme is build. So of course they would have some LEGO stuff. But you can see they have some Batman stuff for some reason, I guess, because Lego Batman movie is coming out. So this isn't Lego, but it's a food container. You see, this is what I'm saying. Like, I don't need a food container. I, I don't I don't want this. So there you go. Next up is a shirt. Um, is this Power Rangers? Yep, Power Rangers. Woohoo, a Power Rangers shirt, which I won't wear because I only wear plain shirts. You see, this is what I'm saying. Loot these loot boxes are not for me. They're just filled with so, and here you go. Here's your exclusive item. I knew it. I, I thought I was hoping people were, were kidding when they said this. They say this was a, it comes with an exclusive Lego Dimensions item. Look what it is. It's a one dollar fun pack that you could get at probably like the dollar store. That is freaking lame. Are you kidding me? Like that? That's not exclusive at all. And it's just kind of false advertising in my opinion. I don't think they should have said it was a limited edition or exclusive. I think they said limited edition instead of exclusive, but this is clearly not limited edition or exclusive either way. So yeah, and it's Cyborg, which I already have a second Cyborg. So this is my third Cyborg fun pack. Oh my gosh. And ooh, what is this? I get, yes, flexible magnet sheets. Just what I wanted. Nope. Oh my gosh, a loop pin. What is this? Okay. Unlock the mysteries. Woohoo. Thanks for the support. Okay, no, I'm never supporting you guys again. This is what I'm saying. That's what a waste of 20 bucks. What a waste of 20 bucks. You could get the cyborg thing on eBay for like three bucks. Okay, look, they're at dollar shirts now for a dollar. The shirt, I don't even watch Power Rangers. There's a lot of just uh, congelation of just pop culture stuff, and it ticks me off because you're paying 20 bucks and they're just giving you stuff like a magnet, a food container. It just doesn't make sense. It ticks me off, I'm telling you. I'm never buying one of these again. They shouldn't have advertised it as a limited edition item, okay? Because this is not limited edition. This is not limited edition. You can get this for like three bucks now because all the LEGO Dimension stuff is on sale from what, year one or most of the LEGO Dimension stuff from year one. So that's it, okay? Angry loot box opening because I don't think it's worth it at all. False advertising. And I hope LEGO never partners with them again because they're going to pull the same crap. I don't even know if LEGO partnered. Maybe they won like a pallet of LEGO Dimension stuff like the dollar stores won and that's how they're at like dollar stores for a dollar. <sighs> Rant over. Loot crate sucks. Oh yeah, my food container, which is not LEGO even though it's trying to look like a LEGO Batman. Let's see. Let's hope it's some good ceramic material. Nope, it's plastic. Okay, let's, let's open it up. Just to face reveal right in that reflection. Ooh, let's let's store some stuff in here. Okay, let me seal it back up. Let's seal it back up. It's garbage. So this is also included in the instructions. They have, uh, or not instructions, but the little thing. They they talk about how you get like I mentioned instructions for I guess these builds if you type in the serial number at the top. I didn't know that. I thought it was only in game. Uh, but also they have an article on how to become a professional master builder. But uh, yeah, kind of interesting little thing, but it's not too much in terms of content. Lock the mysteries. Yes, the mystery is that uh, Loot Crate is putting out some quality products. You can see this one seals perfectly. So yeah, Loot Crate. Twenty dollars. Twenty bucks. This is literally the only thing I'm going to use from here. Well, I guess besides the Lego thing, but like I can get that for like three bucks. Fantastic quality product. Yeah, we, we don't need scissors for this. We gotta. Yeah. We're building the robot. Just too good. We're building the robot. We're building the robot. Come on, it's a loot crate. It's a loot crate. You didn't even do that bad a job. Shoot. You said you were gonna. You said you were gonna. I was. I'm not trying to. It says peel here. It says peel here. It says use scissors. Oh, it does. Right here. <laughs> <laughs> oh jeez. Use scissors or ask for assistance if needed. We don't need your assistance. I'm like a child. Yeah. So 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 here's the loot crate build robot. Honestly, it's not. It doesn't look that bad. But. Not worth 20 bucks, okay? Not worth 20 bucks. I, I feel bad for hitting it, actually, you know. It's mine. Can I hit it? Yeah, you could hit it. <laughs> Just too jarred. All right, in all real talk, I mean, don't worry. The, the items are not going to go to the trash or anything. I know somebody's going to take it. But yeah, I just, I don't feel like this was worth it for 20 bucks. They advertise it as a big thing. You know, we got a lot of Lego fans buying the Loot Crate now, but 
all it was was just a fun pack which you could get easily at the store for five bucks or cheaper. I mean, dollar stores have it for like a dollar from my understanding if it's a cyborg one. So yeah, that's it. I, I just don't think it was worth it. So that's it for the Loot Crate video. This is actually really fun to do. And uh, see you guys later. Peace out. Bye.